Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? Back here again with another video for y'all guys today. I just made a video of my most recent Darvish pickup. Um, as you can see right there in the background, on the left hand side is the white, well, one of one. Pretty sick card. So, if y'all guys haven't seen that video, please go watch it. And in that last video, I also um, explained about my new camera that I received. And I was uh, just made this video with the camera and stumbled across something I did not like at all. First flaw I have found, and I do not like it. The video was a little over 15 minutes, which is a little bit extreme. But uh, went ahead and did it because I think it was a big deal. And it says that I cannot upload videos longer than 15 minutes. So I have to do them in like segments. And to me, that really sucks because I like to do all in one video. Don't like to have uh, different segments or even just cut off the video into one video, if you know what I mean. I like to have it all as one, but you know, that's a little complaint. Nothing too big. I'm going to work with it. No problem. But uh, yeah, that happened. And uh, so I'm going to remake this video because I already had the video done. And now I'm um, going to redo it. And now I'm back on my phone. But since I'm on my phone right now, I'll show you guys the camera. I haven't really taken off everything, but it's actually pretty legit, so, let's see that, so we got that on it, yeah, it's a pretty, pretty sick camera, I could lie, there are the ports right there, and the uh, microphone's up there, so that's why it's kind of hard to talk on, because it's like towards the top, and I'm like talking behind it, but you know, still very sick camera, Samsung, and a real small, real lightweight, real easy to use, you know, very happy with this so I'm just going to have to keep that 15 minute thing in mind so um, yeah I was mad too because I was like 15 minutes and like 40 or 50 something seconds so yeah pretty bummed about that but still this is my new camera pretty legit guys so yeah that is what I'll be using from here on out except for this video because it's probably going to be a pretty lengthy one so Please stay tuned till the end. Um, basically what this is going to be, this is going to be my Adrian Beltre PC showcase. I have not made one of these. I wanted to wait until my PC showcase to get a little bit bigger. And it's accumulated to a you know pretty, pretty decent stack. I mean the ones in the background right now are the ones that are like uh, my patches and like Magworthy. And then I got these too. So uh, yeah, it's come a long way for just three months. But um gonna try and get right into it without any hesitation even though I'm, I'm already you know, almost three minutes into it I haven't showed anything but uh I'll take this off camera for right now so let's go ahead and jump right into it so uh, please stick to the end if possible if not I apologize it's probably gonna be a longer video but I uh, just want to show you guys my collection and you know what I admire the most so here's some uh, simple bass um, my good boy say my good boy but my boy Max V, aka uh, Belcher Fan 29, here on um, YouTube and Instagram, hooked me up with these bass in a care package. Really appreciate that, man, because I knew I was going to use them for my uh, Belcher PC video. So those are some bass right there. And then next is a, uh, you guys have seen this already before, it's a 2013 Topps Chrome uh, unfinished set of the rainbow that I was doing. Um, it's the refractor and these are not in any order so the blue the X fractor orange purple sepia gold red and black oops and I saw the atomic and the pink on eBay but I'm just hesitant on picking them up because I really don't know if I'd be able to find the uh, um, super fractor and any of that so I know I found the printing plate as well so I'd be missing one but hell I may just go for it so that's that Let's get on to some Jersey Relics and some patches. Unfortunately, I do not have any Beltre autos because you guys do know that he is not with Tops to do autos, um, especially in his Texas Uni, and that's what I really want is his Texas uniform. So, um, yeah, don't have any of those, but I do have uh, two pickups coming in, and I did find one that did have a Texas Uni on it. Uh, no logo because it's a uh, Panini, but still, no complaints. So we'll jump into this stack right here, and uh, one by one, this, uh, National Treasures numbered out of 99 right there this is out of museum collection four piece three jersey one four color patch numbered out of 25 right there in the middle this is from tribute the green out of 25 single relic 
pretty nice. Tribute out of 24. Nasty patch on that one. Really like that one. See, the camera focuses really well compared to my phone, so that's one thing. I like about the camera for sure. Gypsy Queen Relic. Uh, 101 printing plate from Tribute. Just a plain old black and white. Uh, please excuse those numbers. This is the top loader that the seller had it in. I didn't take it out. I left it in there. So and you can see it's a 101 right up there. Plain Jane, black and white. And uh, from Top's Finest, one of one. Magenta printing plate. Um, 2013 finest Adrian Beltre, the magenta, and this is a quad double patch jersey bat of Elvis Andrews, Adrian Beltre, U Darvish, and Ian Kinsler out of 99. Pretty sick patches on that one. And next is uh, well, actually they're the same, but uh, one silver and one's like a bronzish uh, jumbo bat from Museum. Silver's out of 25 can see that I guess not because my phone is stupid and then the one out of five five of five pretty sick on that one please excuse that focus pissing me off and this one's from a uh, panini prime cuts five color patch on that one pretty sick this focus is driving me fucking insane excuse my French and that is numbered out of 25 and let's see, uh, tribute number out of 15, Jersey Swatch. I guess the goldish variation from tribute. And then from 2014, Bowman, the red ice, whatever, whatever. Pretty sick, icy looking effect. And that one is numbered out of 25. So that's those. And then let's get into some mag worthy stuff. Here's some of the bigger stuff, the nicer patches. Um, let's go one by one on these. Um, from Triple Threads, it's the base relic, Unity relic out of 36. Then we got the Sepia out of. Oh, Lordy Lord. Don't start this. Out of 27. Emerald out of 18 and then the gold out of 9 3 color patch numbered 8 out of 9 bulging out of the card with that patch pretty freaking sexy if you ask me and then the sapphire numbered 1 of 3 nasty 4 color patch on that one so on this set right here I'm just missing the uh, ruby 101 so if y'all guys happen to see that please let me know um, Sapphire 1 of 3, 4 color patch. Playing gorgeous. Had to pick these up. Next is a. Oh, let's see here. Next is the other triple thread set that I was working on. Um, the green is actually on eBay right now, so I may pick that up here in a whole sec. Uh, another one here. This one actually has the stats on it. And it's obviously not going to focus. 321, 36, 102. That is his average home runs and RBI, obviously. And we're at 36. Please excuse the tape. And then this one, uh, the Sepia out of 27. And this one, I am missing the green. Like I said, it's on eBay, so I'll probably be picking that up here pretty soon. And then here is the Sapphire. I know I did this out of order, but 3 out of 3. Nice three color patch in the middle. Six, six, six patch. Probably my favorite one. And then the gold. Four out of nine. Six, two, well, three color patch on that one. So, yeah, that's my triple thread set I'm working on. Please let me know if you see the Ruby 101s. I see the, or I saw the green, so I'll probably be picking that up. So, any of the Ruby 101s, please let me know. We'll trade big or buy big, pay big for those. And of course, the last three, um, probably my favorite bill trays that I do own. They're all sick. And one of them I just received from my good buddy on here, like I said. Um, Cooperstown Collector on Instagram and Baseball Cards 40 underscore here on YouTube. My good buddy Kyle, we made a trade for this one. And I'm so glad to have it in my PC. It is from 
Tribute. I had the single swatch earlier from 2013. Tribute. Boom. Red variation. Ruby variation. Nice four color patch right there. Number 10 out of 10. Absolutely stunning card. Love the way the red pops. It's just a very shiny piece. Absolutely stunning. Really appreciate that deal, bro. Goes great with the rest of these. Uh, next is from 2014 Gypsy Queen. Another one of my favorites. Hell, they're all my favorites. I'm going to keep on saying that. Number 4 out of 10. From 2014 Gypsy Queen. Bada bing. That is a four color patch on that bad boy. Right there. Probably like from his number I'm thinking maybe. But absolutely sick patch on that one. I love how it's like taking up the whole space. The whole open cut area. So absolutely awesome. And last but definitely not least. Super low numbered. From 2014 Museum. Five color patch on this one. Red, white, and blue, and black and gray. Numbered 5 out of 5 from 2014 Museum Collection. This one's popping out of the card. Feels awesome to touch. Absolutely love it. Speechless, speechless, speechless. So yeah, guys, that is what I have right now. Um, like I said, nothing too big, but over three months, hey, no complaints, you know. Got all these stacks of some jerseys and some base and parallels and stuff. And then, of course, the ones that you just seen, all the uh, patches and triple threads. So, pretty, pretty um, content on where I'm at with my Beltray PC. Well, that's my Beltray be uh, bobblehead in the background. Let me show you guys. It is uh, one of the giveaways that they have at the stadium. It was uh, sponsored by the Medical Center in Arlington, of course. As you guys can see, that's his uh, gold glove right there. And uh, sadly enough, there should be a bat right there. But uh, this bobblehead was obviously a dud because it's supposed to go screwed in there somehow and uh, did not want to screw in. So eventually I wound up giving up and said to hell with it. Don't care, but it's still a pretty nice looking bobblehead. Love that it had the gold glove and uh, somewhat on point, I guess. Looks kind of cockeyed, but you know, still love it. Still love it. So, uh, oh, and there's my uh, Darvish bobblehead right there. Doo -doo -doo. As a career strikeouts counter, not really keeping up with that, but you know, whatever. Just got the bobblehead because I liked it. There's another one that just was given out this season, I'm probably going to pick up. And then, of course, from my last video, my Darvish 101 White Whale. Um, please go watch that last video. Pretty sick pickup. So, um, yeah, guys, I uh, appreciate you guys watching. And this is. Um, been my Adrian Beltray PC showcase. Uh, um, that's pretty much all there is to it. If y'all have any Beltrays, please let me know. Uh, one on one rubies, uh, patches, even autos. I don't even care at this point whether they're in his Dodgers, Seattle Uni, whatever it is. So uh, let me know, guys, and uh, let me know what you guys think of my PC showcase. And uh, like I said, big shout out to Beltray Fan 29 and uh, Baseball Cards 40. Please go give them a, a sub and a follow, please. And uh, that is all, guys. I'm out of here. Peace. Happy collecting. And until next time, bye.